Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night. Wherever you happen to be, whatever you happen to be doing, I hope you are enjoying yourselves. This is Alan Gibson of J Soccer Magazine wishing you the best today. Even if it happens to be 2017, this broadcast is five years old and it still only has 47 hits. I thank you for watching. Today I'm, yes, I'm wearing a suit. Today I'm interviewing Kunishige Kamamoto of uh, Gambo Osaka fame, a uh, coach back in 1993 onwards, and 1968 Olympics goal scorer in Mexico, superstar extraordinaire. Hopefully he'll give us some insights on what it was like in the old days compared to the new days and what he's doing now. But I digress because that is issue four. Also in issue four, Urawa Reds rise again. Makino, Abe, Naoki Yamada, much, much more. Giveaways, sign things, all sorts of stuff. Hopefully we'll have a look at the J-League mascots, those little cute things that jump around the field and irritate the kids. We have some exclusive pictures of the national team, as always. And we have pictures of you. Send in your pictures. You at a game, you waving your flags, you with a player. Japanese, of course, because this is J Soccer Magazine. Um, did you know? We'll have some odd facts and odds and ends for you. Hopefully a Sawa Homare interview. I've joined a very long line, and I have a promise, and it could come, uh, could come true in a month or two. So, uh, Nadeshiko Sawa will get an interview in J Soccer Magazine. Some predictions. If you have some predictions, let me know that you'd like to be in J Soccer Magazine. Maybe your predictions can be in J Soccer Magazine. Uh, some interviews from lesser known players, as always. Hopefully, Paul Williams of Asian Football Feast will be in touch with something very interesting. Uh, J League legend. Well, the J League legend will be Kunishige Kamamoto this time. Uh, I'm also thinking of returning to a J League legend since uh, Wagner Lopez from issue two is now just down the road and very happy to talk. Who knows, there should be a London Olympic 2012 preview, presuming that the men qualify very soon, tonight in fact. Um, then I think I'd like to take a look at the national team's shirts behind me, just above uh, Omiya, Adija, Nakata, Sanfrecce and Van Fore, we have a whole bunch of Japan national team shirts uh, from 1970s upwards to 2012. I'd like to look at the history of the Japan national team shirt into the net, your blogs in English, anything on the interviews, anything in English on the J League, tell me about it and I will put it in the magazine. We'll have a page or two or three or four of reference of things that uh, people can look up on the web. Let's spread the word of Japanese football in English and French and Portuguese and whatever to the world. Let's have a look at issue three, shall we? Why not? Do you have issue three yet? If you don't have issue three yet, why not? It's now available on a PDF. Please mail me at alan at jsoccer.com, A-L-A-N at jsoccer.com. The PDF is 600 yen. The cover price is 600 yen. It's there somewhere. There it is. And uh, if you'd like to buy it on eBay, it is there. Uh, look for J Soccer. There's nothing else under J Soccer without a space except for J Soccer magazines and other stuff. So J Soccer magazine is available on eBay. It's available through the website, www.jsoccer.com. Uh, you can get in touch with me on Twitter at Japan, oh, excuse me, at J Soccer Magazine. If that doesn't give you enough options and you can't get your J Soccer Magazine, well, what else can I do for you? I can't make it any easier. This was issue three with Sunyasu Miyamoto on the front. And inside we had a review of the 2011 season from Ben Mabley. Some lovely pictures of Sawa Homare at her Ballon d'Or ceremony. Uh, look at Cerezo Osaka and a superb picture of Kiyotake there. Uh, that was by Steve Nelson of J Soccer Magazine. Thank you, Steve. There's uh, Ben Mabley's article, by the way, a J1 pre uh, review. Uh, we had a little bit of Michael Hudson. My name is Michael and I'm an Ardisha supporter. Well, somebody's got to be one, haven't they? November 1997. Exclusive pictures from my own collection. When Japan beat Iran 3-2 and qualified for the 1998 World Cup. And it's all been uphill from there, right? Miyamoto Suniyasu. He retired, he made the cover, he made inside four pages a pictorial appreciation of Tsune. Uh, again, pictures from my collection. It's been a while. There is the uh, downfall of Ura Reds by Mario in Germany. Thank you for that. Uh, by the way, in issue four, well, you know, the rise of around red so we get to that daniel jones wrote us about yokohama flugels if you've never even heard of yokohama flugels well that's what the f in marinos is all about and that wasn't a pun yokohama f marinos the f stands for flugels 
and uh, they are remembered forever. We also took an opportunity to put some pictures of Messi and Neymar and Barcelona and Santos in the magazine since the Club World Cup did happen in Japan last December. Exclusive pictures. Uh, race I'll also get a good look in, of course. Yeah. What else have we got in here? Oh, yes. Two superb interviews by Paul Williams of Asian Football Feast. Mexican standout, Yuto Ono, Yuji Ono's brother. And El Ultimo Samurai, Mr. Hiroshi Ibuski, making big waves in uh, Sevilla in Spain right now. And your pictures. It's a family affair. It is indeed. If you have pictures of you with a player at a game, please send them in to alan at jsoccer.com and we'll let you know. This was issue two, by the way. Tadadari Lee, hello Southampton. And Freddie Ljungberg, goodbye Japan. Well, it was good while it lasted. Thank you, Freddie, for a little bit of your time. And back issue is also available, issue number one. Takashi Usami and Endo Yasuhito made the cover. And exclusive interview. On the back we had an exclusive picture of Naoki Yamada of Urawa Reds. And inside, lots and lots of stuff. Please, buy a J Soccer magazine. 600 yen, plus postage worldwide. In Japan, just 800 yen will get you Yamato trackable postage. Worldwide, just 900 yen. And if you buy one, buy two, buy three. I'll do you a good deal on the postage. PDFs now also available, 600 yen. And no postage, of course, for the PDF. By email, drop me a line, alan at jsoccer.com. alan at jsoccer.com to get your PDF of issue three for 600. If you buy a PDF of issue three for 600, I'll throw in issue two and issue one, all for 1,000 yen. Can I offer you anything better? Enjoy the games tonight, Japan. Under 23 qualifying for the London Olympics 2012. This was sponsored by Dr. Pepper. Thank you and goodbye.